We are inheriting a planet that is unwell. Air pollution is one of the largest environmental health risks in our cities. Almost everybody is breathing unhealthy air. But we bear the burden of its impacts. About 1 billion children are exposed to exceedingly high levels of air pollution. We are uniquely vulnerable as these impacts begin at the time of conception, continue during childhood, and can even affect our overall learning and development. We are now at the front line of an environmental crisis we played no part in creating. This task is daunting, but solutions exist. Building on UNEP's 25 clean air solutions, UNICEF and UNEP developed a guide on 20 child-centered clean air solutions to address air pollution and realize our right to clean air and a stable climate. These solutions focus on addressing emissions in microenvironments where children and young people are exposed, such as where we live, where we play, where we learn, and when we travel. Two examples of these solutions include providing clean cooking and heating options for the home and for commercial areas, including street markets and school canteens and to mainstream electric mobility and low emission vehicles, such as converting diesel-powered school buses to electric. We must work together to make these solutions a reality. Active engagement of children and youth in appreciating and protecting the environment is critical to achieve our shared sustainable development goals. We are not mere bystanders in this public health crisis. All over the world, young people are already raising their voices and taking to the stage to fight against air pollution. We are ready to take this challenge. And when we work together, we are unstoppable. Together, we can protect the air we share. But we need your support. This cannot happen without the right investments, right policies, and right action. Join us to make this happen and help secure the fundamental right of every child to breathe clean air.